And welcome back to another gravy gaming session here. We're going to be doing day three selection of Parasite Eve. Uh, let's get started. Will I save my progress? No, we have save states. Uh, I apologize for the last stream. I felt as if I was lacking energy, which I kind of was. I had been... Um, you know, I've been very busy throughout the day, so I wasn't as energetic or into it. I was a little tired while playing, to be honest, so hopefully this stream, well, this video will actually be a little more energetic and I'll be back to my normal self, so let's get started with the uh, voice re the voice acting here. Hey, uh, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> So, what's in here? Ammo. We're in some random dirty New York apartment with a trash can in the middle of the living room. I guess the heat's off. Let's head out now. So, in the last chapter, Eve had made the whole audience of the concert into a pile of goo. And Dr. Uh, Maida here is trying to shine some light on what's going on. So, Maida, that was a long night. Sleep well? Aya, you were here all night? I told you to go away. You could have died, you know. There, the music kicks in. This guy's pretty cool, actually. Maida. Scientists can't believe anything without proof. It's it's just one of those things. And besides, what? Oh, nothing. Daniel rolling up. Daniel? Hmm. No traffic. This is a this is the way it ought to be around here. Daniel. You know, I found it funny how last stream they said that nobody was in New York because everybody had already been gone for the holidays, but that doesn't make any sense because around the holidays, like, tons of people, like, mainly tourists, come in from outside the city to check out Rockefeller Center and the Christmas tree lighting and, you know, do all that touristy stuff at the end of the year. And then there's the whole, you know, New Year's Eve party where Times Square is just filled up. So, you know, that explanation didn't make sense and I kind of overlooked it. <laughs> I think that's hilarious. So, what are we sitting around for? We got work to do. Damn right, let's go kill some shit. Daniel, thanks. All right, we're gonna need some bigger weapons. There's a gun shop over there. Let's stock up. Huh. Now a gun shop in New York City. I don't think that's real. <laughs> I believe there's a pharmacy over there. <laughs> okay, the pharmacy I'll get, there's Dwayne Reed everywhere, but I'm not sure about a gun shop in New York. Hey, let's lose those... Let's lose the long face. Come on, Ayo. Let's go, we gotta stock up. So, do I go on the other side of the car? Or down the street? We'll go down the street. Okay, it's down the street. I mean, maybe I'm wrong, maybe there are gun shops in New York. I mean, it's not illegal, but guns in New York are just, you know, it's not like Texas or something like that. Meta, they weren't kidding when they said they sell guns here in America. Where are they? <laughs> this is it. We'll help ourselves with some ammo. Like, that would have been so securely, like, locked. Out of the way, eh? There would have been, uh, steel doors over that. Daniel, no. Sorry, but it's the only way. Ooh. Yo, he didn't even tell her to move. What a jerk. Are are you really a cop? <laughs> we think so, but we don't have scientific proof, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> I 
that's kind of that is kind of true just breaking and entering all right let's pick up some stuff i see a box my inventory is full replace an item i don't know what's in here well, oh poison for some range that's a decent trade-off go here more ammo look, look at all these guns like why can't i pick something why can't you just grab anything made of this is too much right just all lying out there for anyone to take that the gun guy back at the precinct is probably upset go ahead and pick out your favorite accessories ladies <laughs> what am i supposed to grab there's something over here ah there inventory full replace item we'll leave the junk bullet capacity by one so i'm supposed to get loaded with that huh all right are we done here can't tell if there's more oh there's more all right let's see what we can get rid of here all right discard this junk although i feel like i remember the junk being important later on in the game like you can like trade it for stuff oh a machine gun that's nice a club <laughs> a second club how wonderful Oh, I already took that. I mean, I guess if I want to smack around Eve with a club, that's the better club to use. Let's see this gun here. M16 versus, I think this is the machine gun I just picked up. All right, let's see. The range is a little shorter. Attack power is shorter. And the bullets are more capacity but it has two shooting modes i guess oh no it goes from i could shoot five bullets hmm more shots i have to get in you know what let's try it out see how that goes okay i think it's time to leave Hopefully I didn't miss anything, but you know what, who cares? All right, let's get out of here. If it's Eve we're dealing with, all the ammo in the world might not even help us. Ugh, Tors will kill me for saying stuff like that. Hmm, I hope these things... I hope these will help us out. Yeah, me too. Alright, let's get out of here. I guess. I guess we're getting out of here. <laughs> this thing about these old PlayStation games, like they just kind of let you try to figure things out. Like this repeat dialogue until you like figure out where you're going. kind of embarrassing okay <laughs> just gotta go back down the street <laughs> oh god all right let's see what they gotta say now I believe there's a pharmacy over there oh we'll go down the street the other street get ourselves some meds I barely have room for anything but you know, it's never stopped me from dropping some junk. Hmm, just the smell of this place gives me the creeps. It's a pharmacy, dude. What are you creeped out about? <laughs> so many types of medication, and they all seem strong, too. Yeah. 
Sudafed. The door is broken. Get some Sudafed in you. That'll stop the mitochondria. Daniel here. What's up with him? All of a sudden, he's a happy camper. I would never understand these scientist types. Can't say we will. Here he is. Yes, yes, I wish I could take all these back to Japan. What, do they not got pharmacies in Japan? I guess he just means all that it, you know, all this stuff lying around. Like this right here, what's in here? Full inventory. Let's replace more junk. A revive, nice. I haven't found one of those yet. I think I missed the one. There was one back in the theater, I believe. Or maybe the chest uh, gives random stuff. I might have just got heals or something. All right, here we go, more full inventory. What else can I drop? I can't drop the Zuki. Hmm. Tools, vests. You know what? I'm gonna do something I said I wasn't gonna do. I'm just gonna use one of these. Enhancements already. Use it on the M16. Make that a little better because that's a pretty decent gun. Medicine too. All right, all right. Not bad at all. What's down this aisle? Absolutely nothing. Just keep walking around aimlessly. Pretty sure that has to be it. Alright, so we'll do a save there. Alright, I think that's all that's in here. This is essentially tw 12 minutes so far into the stream, and I've done nothing but go to a gun store and a pharmacy. Shall we go now? I'd like to test some mine. Shall we go now? I'd like to conduct some minor tests. Yeah, let's go. Let's do this. If we're stuck, let's move out of here. That's exactly what I want to do. Let's get back to the action. The action, the story here. <laughs> Alright, so... Pretty sure I just gotta talk to Daniel here. Hey, you're supposed to be up front with me. Okay, let's go up to the front. Before we go, let's see what he's got to say. Is there a place nearby with a good research facility? I'd like to test something. Wrong cops, buddy. Are right, we set, Aya? Yes, road rules don't apply here anymore. We can take the shortest route through Manhattan. True, it's empty. I mean, I would have, I would have left. But you know there's some people that are still like, I ain't leaving. This is my city. Soho. So where do we go now? Carnegie Hall, we've been there. The museum. Hmm, there's research there. Okay, Maida said he wants to go somewhere with a research lab. That's, this is the only place thus far. So maybe it's a quick detour there, otherwise I'm heading back to the police station. So, where to? Is there any place with a is there any place with a research facility? A research facility. I'd like to conduct an experiment and test something. It might be relevant. How about the facility in the museum where Doc where Clamp is at? They had really extensive equipment there. No way, man. Anywhere but there. He should have been he should have been edu he should have been evacuated by now. It should be okay. Er, yeah, that sounds good. Daniel, is that okay? I'm expecting a big tip for this. Look how they just fly through those New York streets. Looks like the I think there was some comment in a previous video that said that it looked like they were going through like the Death Star trench run. <laughs> 
like that was that was actually pretty funny because it does look like that. So this is the American Museum of Natural History. It's just as I imagined. I can find a research facility in this building. Yeah, hopefully we won't run into the jerk who runs it. Since it's since he's been evacuated, it should be empty. Yeah, somehow I have a feeling that things aren't going to be as you know. What could we what we imagine? Oh wow, nothing. Hmm. For a lab and for a lab and a museum, it does have a fairly extensive equipment. So what do you want to test? Yes, yes, of course. Let me see. I was able to extract the gel-like substance from Aya's clothing. Gel? Is it from Eve? Yes, it appears to be a remnant of Eve's cells. Ew, that's gross. At the cellular level, her power cannot be as strong as Aya previously said. As Aya said previously. If you hear anything in the background, that is because there is a whole ton of uh, wind here today. It's very windy, and I've got trees surrounding my house, so you're gonna you might hear the them you know whipping around and the wind blowing. So don't mind that. Ow! Hey there, what are you doing? I just want to conduct this experiment to see whether or not. Microscope sounds. Hmm, yes, yes, this is exactly as I... It's just as I thought. Go ahead, take a look. What is it? Another FMV here. I don't know what that's supposed to be. But this is some creepy science fiction stuff right here. Like what what is that supposed to be? Like Aya's cells? And those sounds they make, that's just creepy. Oh, they're attacking the nucleus. Your cells are completely surrounded by them. As you can see, the mitochondria, or Eve, has taken over the nucleus. In a similar manner, the beasts that attacked you probably experienced the same thing. Does the mitochondria really have the power to control the nucleus? No, the normal mitochondria never has such power. But Eve's mitochondria has gone through tremendous evolutionary changes. This is what I think happened to Eve's mitochondria. Normally, mitochondria require oxygen when they generate an energy known as ATP. Alright, I added some words there, but... So at this time, the mitochondria requests energy from the nucleus. Without the energy supply from the mitochondria, the nucleus cannot function. So in essence, the two organelles constantly rely on each other. Constantly rely on each other. But in this case, it seems that Eve developed the power to reverse this symbiotic relationship. Evolution, or even mutation, seems likely in this case. Reverse the cycle? Look at this. Even with a limited number of her... Even with a limited number of cells, her cells have this much power. Can you imagine how much power Eve has within her whole body? Maida. Yes? Could you test my cells? Yes, of course, but I want to know. I want to know why I have the power to fight her. I want to know where I stand with her. Hey, uh, please, Maida. I need to know why. Okay. <laughs> yes, of course. Thanks, Maida. Could you step over here, please? I'll need your arm. Like this? Here. Yes, yes. Ow. Let me just set this up here.
Really? She said ow to a needle? Either he was just <laughs> unnecessarily rough or what? Hmm. I think you'd better see for yourself. What is it? Is something wrong? Another movie. What's going on here? The life stream is invading the cells. Oh. Oh. Her nucleus is fighting back. Her nucleus is mutated. Do you realize what is happening? Your mitochondria are supplying more energy to the nuclei of your cells. It's almost as if they are protecting the nuclei from Eve's mitochondria. Why does Eve's mitochondria have this kind of power? I don't know, I just... Are you familiar with Richard Dawkins' theory of the selfish gene? I think I might have read part of that. In simple terms, it states that genes act in a manner to preserve and ensure survival of the species. Hey man, I don't read those scientific journals. What are you trying to say? Depending on how you look at it, you can say that Eve is trying to destroy all mitochondria except her own. In response to that, Aya's mitochondria has developed the power to rebel. Why only Aya's? Shouldn't it be the same for us as well? We should have known that power based on... That seems to follow the natural order of things, but I'm sorry, I don't know why. Yo! Professor? What are you doing in my lab? This is breaking and entering. We're cops, bro. Why haven't you evacuated the city yet? I'm asking why are you people in my lab? We're, we're just... We've received orders to evacuate this city. Professor, you really should... I tell you, cops are the ones corrupting this fine city. Yo, 90s New York was no joke. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, it was my fault. You see, I asked him to bring me here. Who the hell are you? Oh, I'm... Huh. Kunehiko Maida. I hope I pronounced that right. And I'm, and I'm a scientist from Japan. You were using my electronic microscope. Uh-oh. What? What is this? Where did you get this specimen? You, where did you get these cells? Those, those are... I, I, I don't know. Do you take me for a fool? With cells like these, they must affect the body's natural state. Er, uh, um... Oh, shut up. I'll just ask Officer Bray. Your cells contain a tremendous amount of energy. Do you feel any bodily changes? I... No, you should feel somewhat... Hot? No. Speak up, officer. I can't hear you. Have you recent... Have you lost consciousness recently? Hey. What the hell is this? Why is, by, why is my boy's name here? Lorraine? Lorraine's on here too. Clamp, you tell me. You, you tell me what this list is for. Tell me, you hear me? Let go of me. I don't have to tell you anything. What? Daniel, calm down. Mm. Daniel? Damn. Yo, if I were him, I would have busted him up. Get out of here. Yo, totally cool if you bust him up. Nobody would say a thing about police brutality. Sorry to disturb you, but we do have a fish. But we do have to officially warn you of the evacuation. Please remember that. Officer Bray, do you enjoy having that barbarian for a partner? <laughs> oh, no, thank you, er, bye. 
too late now. It's too late to do anything now. They left her cells there too. I wonder if that has anything to do with anything later on. <sighs> Alright. So, let's head back to the police department since I can't imagine going anywhere else at this point. Maybe go back to the pharmacy? Damn him. One of these days. What was that list? It was an HLA type listing. It's a list to see whether organs were... It's a list to see whether organs will be rejected when... <clears throat> That's what... Ooh, excuse me. It will be a list to see where... Whether organs will be rejected when transplanted. Why the hell are Ben and Lorraine on the list? It was a list of people with matching HLA types, so... Damn, I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna go back to the station and get in the... Seriously, I wouldn't blame him. He can definitely, you know, beat the shit out of him. New York Police Department. Oh, I think I remember what comes next here. Oh yeah. What the hell happened here? Eve? She, she's here? I'll go look around. You two stay here. Hell no. I'm not gonna sit around and wait for this thing to kill my family. Daniel. Dude, you got set on fire the last time. Wait. Hey, wait. Here, take this. What's this? It's a good luck charm from Japan. It's the best I can do. I see you can't hold any more. I'll wait here then. Please be careful. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, um... I don't know. I don't even know. Anymore here. We'll put some defense on... Which vest here? Look, that one. Okay. We'll take this good luck charm. Hamaya. Please be careful. I will, wait. I will wait for you here. So what does this Hamaya do? Doesn't do anything apparently. Alright. Let's go into the police department. Clearly Eve is there. Oh, dead body. I'm getting help. Hang on. He did not respond. All right. Let's check the locker room. Another body. Hold on. Where you go? Door locked. Door locked. Nope. Wow, I keep hitting the wrong button. My fingers aren't my fingers aren't good today. <laughs> oh man. Okay, so ooh, a boss a fight. Not a boss fight. Alright, got my machine gun. Looks like an evolved sort of rat here, so. Oh! That's neat. Yo, that gun's pretty sweet. Oh, I can't pick up the gun. Can't pick up the medicine, apparently. See, I don't know, that's kind of weird how it choke. So the machine gun chooses random targets, which I don't really feel like I'm cool with that. So I'm gonna switch back to the M16. You know, I just want to point and shoot at, you know, the target I choose. Let's see how the main... Uh-oh. Which, which guy is this? Warner. Hey, uh, man. Eve really caught us off guard. 
Most of our men were out. I'm getting help. Hang on. No worries. I'll be alright. You go after Ben. See, I'm just kind of surprised that all these people are still alive. Like, she should have just set them on fire. Oh, another body. Are you okay? Where's the captain? He went to look for Ben. No, hold on, please. Alright, so Ben, that is Daniel's son, he is in the precinct. So, we're searching for him. So, if I recall correctly, this battle should lead me. I have a feeling I remember where the battle is, but I'm just going to check around for more stuff just to, you know, load up. Okay. Okay, I was going to shoot that guy, but I figured I could dodge him. Oh! Two shots at almost. Oof. Got him. And the stupid bird. Stupid New York pigeons. Got it. Oh, no. Alright. Definitely need that offense. What can I drop here? My guy. <laughs> Can I drop the club? Oh, nice. Okay, so I dropped the club, I left the medicine. So I'm actually just gonna take one of the... I'm gonna take this medicine to make some space. I'm gonna see if I can drop off all these different little knickknacks I got on me with the the uh, storage guy. Wait, it's me! Hey, uh, this freak of a dog got Torres. Hey, uh, guess I screwed up, huh? Why? Why didn't you shoot, man? Haven't used guns since... since your daughter was shot? Torres, you can't blame guns for that. I suppose you're right. Wayne, you take care of this place now. Torres! No, Torres. No, oh, well. This gun, it's it's Torres' gun. Hasn't used it in ages, but he always kept it in shape. Torres wasn't just good at gun tune-ups. He was a good shot too. Ever since his daughter was killed by a gun accidentally going off, he stopped shooting altogether and came to to check this department to keep guns in check. Hey, I know you can handle this gun. Take this and nail that monster for Torres. Will do, man, will do. This one's is for you, Torres. All right, if you want to leave something here, we'll hold it. Ah, oh, beautiful. Oh, I have no junk. Definitely take. All right, beautiful. So, take that, take that, see, I believe saving all these for later allows you to make some better guns and armor from, uh, basically better guns and armor, because <laughs> these are just, you know, the starters in the game. So, but then again, I'm not entirely sure because I only ever rented this game from Blockbuster, so I never really got to the, the sort of end game stuff. Ugh. All right, revive and clear inventory. All right, let's move some of the, the equipment too. So, get 
get rid of this vest. Get rid of this machine. No. Get rid of this machine gun. Like it was cool for a second, but I have a feeling it was going to be, uh, you know, too wild. Grenade launcher. That you'd think that would be super strong, but it was just not. So I'm going to keep. Should I even bother keeping this handgun? Yeah, I'll keep the handgun. Tune ups. I have three tools. Oh, I think I like. You can like create stuff. But I'm not gonna try that. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing with that. But points. What are these points for? Oh, you can add. Okay, so you can customize the guns guns a little better. So I can put 21 bullets in my M16 or raise its attack, the range. Oof. I th hmm. You know what? I'm going to keep going with what I've got so far and save those points up. Cuz I have a feeling I can make something real cool later on if I do. Alright, so we got the medicine. Or maybe I'm gonna regret or maybe I'm gonna regret that decision later. <laughs> I might be too weak to fight off whatever is coming. I doubt it though. Alright, so this door over here was previously closed. I think that was the dog kennel door. Uh oh. No, not Kathy. She had all the gossip. She had all the hot goss. I'm sorry. Ben's gone. Where? I don't know. Shiva went berserk, and Ben went after her. What? No, not chatty Kathy. Oh, fight time. Oh, these monsters. I feel like I have to stay on there. Oh, what is that? Oh god, they trapped me. I am trapped. Oh, thank god for that revive. <laughs> Save the game there. <laughs> oh god. Maybe I should... <laughs> Maybe I should have, uh... Yo, they hit hard. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, thank god. Alright, let's do some heals, because he hits so hard. I think I might kill him with these next two shots, though. Oh, thank God. Whew, that was... That was intense. <laughs> if I didn't have that save, I don't know what I would have done. Not that save, the uh, revive. So we're back at full health. There's the berserk dog. Shiva! Stop! Come back here! I think they're telling me to hurry it along. Blocked. All right. Let's head after. Oh, another body. Is that Daniel? 
Oh no, it's Warren? Nix. Aya, you better get up to... You gotta go after Ben. He went upstairs after chasing Shiva. Come on, we need to take care of that wound. I'm alright, just go after Ben. Gave me some bullets. Alright, let's check in here if there's anything. The thing about these RPG games, it's like, if you were actually following the intensity of the game, you'd be like, just following everything and missing items and like, experience points. Like this spider thing is so... Oh, it causes a slow effect. And I'm trapped. Why am I trapped? Okay, I can get up on the stage. Cool, I didn't realize that. So, let me shoot this thing. There we go. More bullets. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right, let's get this chest. Ooh, another high defense, strong against SA. Let's see, that's why I don't upgrade anything, because there's always something else along the way. Oh, look at that. Way more defense, way more energy, higher crit, auto something. Auto medicine when HP is low. Ooh. Now that saves me some turns in combat. See, that's what I'm talking about. Like, you get something like that, you don't want to be wasting your, you know, stat boosts on stuff that's not even going to have any auto skills or anything like that. That was a, see, that's a good detour. That was a good one. Alright, so we took a little pause in the action here to uh, go get a drink because my mouth was getting dry. So, let us continue, even though for you it was only a second, for me it was about a minute. Oh, I didn't check the body. Does this guy not talk? Nope, he dead. But, uh, if you've been listening to the streams and you have any questions for me about my you know, my narration work, or my stories, moderating the short series stories, um, you know, leave it in the comments. Ooh, Shiva's growling. Shiva, don't go that way. You know, Shiva, what happened to you? Shiva, wait. Oh, rats. <laughs> But yeah, like I was saying, if you've got any questions, comments, whatever, just leave them in the comment section of this video and I'll try to answer them in my next stream. Which should be sometime in the week. I only play this game- oh! Not these guys again. I'm gonna save. Ooh, that's a big hit. So it seems as if it's those... It seems as if those energy blasts go down the further away you are from them. Do I get a level here? No. More medicine, though. That helps with my new auto-medicine ability. What's in the box? What's in the box, man? More me Wow, that's a full heal medicine three. Sweet. Ooh, what's this thing here? It's shiny, therefore they want you to pick it up. Why can't I pick it up? Storage key. Oh, that's for that downstairs area that I couldn't open earlier. I'm guessing I should go back there? Should I go back there? You know, I'm gonna go back there. You know what, it's like the game's telling you, go back there, there's something that'll help you out with all this, you know, BS you're dealing with. So, let's take a quick trip down, I'll 
I'll do a frame rate skip, that way we're not taking too long. This door right here. There we go. What could be in here? Certainly doesn't hurt. Oh, another machine gun? See, that's what I'm talking about. A tool. Something to save for later. And an offense plus one. Eh, wasn't as grab rigging as I thought, but still better than nothing. Oh, look at that. More attack. Less range. 24 bullets. But it fires three shots. You know what? I'm going to keep this on me. I'm going to keep that on me and see how it goes. You know what? I'm going to equip it. I'm going to change it. I could change it later if necessary. We'll see how it goes. Alright. Let us. Let's frame rate skip back to where we were. I'm used to playing games like th at this speed now, because why take so long when you can do it in so little time? All the uh, recent re-releases of the Final Fantasy series, they all have this like speed up option, and it makes like it makes the game so much more bearable. Oh, oh, that was a beating. I could get away from them. That was a beating and a half. I'll take that. Alright, they seem kind of lost. Now they're coming at. Do I have any power? Oh, I haven't been using my barriers. I forgot I had a barrier. what happens when you don't play in a long time. It's been about a week since I played, so I should remember having the barrier, but... There it is. Perfect. Gained a level. Some items, bonus points. Parasite powers have evolved. Energy shot. Channel energy into a bullet. Interesting. Okay. I think that's going to do some major damage. At least I hope it does some major damage. What's in this room? Safe point and a box. Critical evasion. So you know when there's a save point, it means shit's about to go down. I'm not sure. I think... I think there's a fight with... There's certainly a fight with the dog, but I'm not sure if there's a battle with Eve in this part of the game again. Shiva, are you okay? Oh no, I think I fight some other monster. Ben, get away from her. Let go, she was sick. Stop, your heart, Shiva. She isn't Shiva. Eve's turned her into a monster. A monster? Close your eyes, Ben. Oh, another creepy ass transformation movie coming up. It's a dog. Oh. Oh, that is so gross. Oh, it's like Cerberus, Cerberus now. Three-headed dog. Jesus H. Christ. <laughs> oh no. You're not touching him. Too bad your bullets aren't infused with mitochondrial fighting 
mitochondria in this. Ah! Great. A battle before the battle. Ooh, that nailed me. The rats got a little tougher, that's for sure. Oh, that's so cool, use the medicine. And they're stocking me up on medicine too, which is rad. Every little bit, you know, every little bit's gonna help. Lab tech, ah! Please, help me! I stepped outside and those things were all over. You'll be safer here, don't leave this room. Lab tech. Okay. Hey, you're hurt. I think I have enough supplies to treat you just once. Do you like some first aid? Come on, I just used the freaking... <sighs> sure. I just used... I think I probably used that full health. I'm sorry, I don't have any more supplies here to treat your wounds. What good are you, scientist lady? Any boxes? Like, why was she untouched? I mean, she just... See, that's the smartest thing to do. Just chill out in the room. And wait until everything blows over. Because everybody's trying to be a hero here. I'm not going to make it. Take the stuff in my locker. What? Locker key. You know what this means, right? Let's take another trip back down to the locker room. Maybe this guy is... Maybe... Oof, okay, that's not bad. Maybe this guy has something interesting in there. Something useful. See, I'm liking these three bullet shots. At first I wasn't too crazy about it. Use a small heel. Just to have room for stuff. But maybe I'll have something cool in that locker room I can use. It's also kind of a risk because as you can see there's random encounters throughout, but you know it might be worth it just to check out what he has in his locker. Might have some crazy bullets or something. That's not where the locker room is. This is the locker room. Trading card? What is this? <laughs> Did I just really go back downstairs for a card? You know what, I have a feeling it's probably going to be something of importance for later. But while we're up, while we're down here, I'm going to go back to the junk dealer guy and, you know, make some space. Or fight some creatures. I'll fight it in fast motion. Oh, well, those birds were incredibly easy to kill. Uh oh. Oh, come on. Alright. We're gonna get rid of the medicine one, in exchange for a medicine two. And we're gonna leave it at that. Not much else I can do there. But once again, we're going to script the frame rates here. Move a little faster. Discard junk. Nail this monster for Torres, eh? If something here, okay. Equipment. We've got. Alright, I'm moving a handgun over. I'm moving the old vest. And I could have sworn I got rid of this club earlier. 
Oh, I couldn't get rid of it. Alright, and now let's store some items. Whew. Prevents stiffness. A tool. Offense, evade, don't need the storage key anymore, don't need the locker key, I don't know if I'll need his good luck charm or not, but it doesn't hurt to have it, so we'll sort all the items there. All right, we're good to go. So let's rush back up. Oh, now we're gonna fight first. Another battle. So what's good about this is I'm gonna get another level. I'm gonna gain another level after this fight, so I'll be a little more prepared to fight off whatever, all well, that three-headed, really? I'll just take the junk for now, get rid of it. I'm gonna fight that three-headed dog. Zipping through, zipping through. Going through, hopefully no random encounter. Yay, no random encounter. This guy, all right, so let's keep going. Just save the game. Oh, crap, went the wrong way. I keep going the right way, we'll slow it down. Alright, getting... Oh wow. Ugh. See how important that vest ability is? That's something that I would definitely inv invest in later. Ha ha ha! Now we gained a level. More points, more HP, more medicine and ammo. Perfect. I don't know what room this is. Uh, looks like some sort of medical room, and of course, a random battle. More spiders, spiders and birds. Oh, that's the stiffness. I have the stiffness debuff, which makes me move slower. See, I think they should definitely make it so that whenever you fire, or you have leftover... Wow, I keep on getting... Hit. Full cure. Oh, that's beautiful. That See, this is room worth going into, even though I didn't know at the time. Okay, so I think we're as prepared as we're going to be for this next battle, which I'm sure is just a, oh my god, another encounter. Same thing, but let's be smart about it, let's go after the big gun first. Okay, there. I guess they decided to do the same thing with me. That guy's a bigger threat. He has that energy move. Damn, use the cure. The full cure on that, I think. That's not so bad. I keep reloading. Keep loading up on stuff. Oh no, I didn't use all negative status. Oh, it's not a feel not a full like health restore.
All right, I think we're heading into battle now. So I saved in the hallway. Hey, uh, hey, Uncle Baker's hurt. Shiva? Oh my God! Look at this silent. It's not Shiva. Shiva's already dead. Hey, please don't let her turn into a monster. How do you? F Come on, I'm. I'm the one you want. Oh god, how do you fight this thing? There are three targets. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. You know what? Let's try this energy shot. Oh, 102 damage. Oh, that drained all my power and it makes her dizzy? Take a big hit. Get out of the way. Take a shot. Dodge that. Alright, this isn't that hard thus far. I'm, you know, I was imagining that tail would have more of a factor in this since it's such a big tail you know there's got to be a tail sweep move yo he healed for a hundred all right let's try this energy shot again I guess oh You ain't got a face no more. So I keep shooting the... Oh. Alright. We reload. <laughs> That's how we do. We're not here to see me fail. Let's see if I shoot that third head, the one that healed itself. Wake up, wake up, wake up! Hit me pretty hard there. Let's see if I keep taking on this third head. Nope, it restored itself. Oh wow, it restored its other head. Then it hit me pretty hard. Jesus. All right. So we're gonna get back into this fight now. happened there. Okay, I took care of one of the heads. There's the other head. So each head has a different amount of... Each head has its own amount of HP. So... Focusing on one of the heads at a time is probably the best course of action. And, you know, avoiding getting shot at in the face. Use this energy shot again. Do some decent damage there. This like headache thing she gets. Oh, that really hurt. Gotta get. Oh, okay, so. Just use another medicine. Like, the attacks aren't hard to dodge, it's just a, a lunge and then that attack. You just gotta stay away. Stay away from that beam attack. 
Oh, and then stay away from its ass. I think I killed... So what's left is the middle head. Which leaves it with a beam attack, which, as you can see, I've been dodging it pretty well. 75 damage there, all crits. Oh, see. That's fine, I've got the medicine, the heals, the self-healing, which takes away... I don't waste turns healing. Got it. Yeah, that's how we do it. Died only once. <laughs> Gained a level. Parasite powers have evolved. Confused targeted enemy. More HP, more levels. Another gun. What kind of gun is this? Probably another handgun. I'll take it though. Excuse me if you heard me burp, I just been drinking some Pepsi while playing and clearing my voice here. Ben, Captain, hey, Uncle Baker's hurt. Ben, Daddy. Ben, are you okay? Uncle Baker was protecting me. Baker looks like he's just having a heart attack. Captain, thank you. Remember when Ben was younger? We used to play it. We all used... We used to all play at your place. Sir, cut that out. Baker is fine. Like the old times. Aww. Glad these tragedies can bring people together. Shiva, Ben... Hey, uh, whoever did this to Shiva, you'll get him, right? Yeah. Yeah, I will. You get him, Aya. You have no other choice. Ah, Conception. Day four. Well then, this marks the end of this video. And despite it being about an hour and seven minutes, it certainly felt a lot shorter to me than day three. I mean, day two. <laughs> I'm telling you, that day I was tired, and I was playing, and I feel like I wasn't as presentable, but for tonight's game, I feel that I think I did a decent job. Um, let me know how you feel about it in the comments, and if you uh, liked it, if you want, if you liked it, if you didn't like it, if you want to tell me I suck, or if you want to tell me I'm a cheater for s using save states, whatever you want to do, just... Leave it in the comments, I'll have a good laugh at it, and you can feel better about leaving me some, you know, hatred. <laughs> Alrighty, see you on, see you next time.